What's going on everybody? In this video, we are gonna be taking a look at the cold TI Titanium. Uh, basically, this is a seed backup wallet. This is a place that you can store your Bitcoin seeds, make sure they're secure, make sure they're fireproof, waterproof, damage proof, you name it. This thing is pretty cool. So in this video, we're gonna take a little closer look at this. So buckle up everybody, let's do it. So maybe you've got yourself a Ledger Nano, you've got some sort of Ledger device or treasure, uh, treasure perhaps. Maybe you even got the Electro Map. You just whatever it is, you've got Bitcoin and you've got to protect your seed words, right? Uh, myself, for the longest time, I used to store mine on a piece of paper. I don't know. Uh, if many people still do this, but that's how I store them. These are obviously not real words, but this is what your seed words look like. If you create your own Bitcoin wallet, you're gonna get a series of words like this, and this is the key to unlock all of your fortune, right? So you wanna keep this as secure and safe as possible because if you lose this, you lost your Bitcoin. It's just that simple, guys. You gotta take a little bit of responsibility and this is how you do it. Writing them on a piece of paper, it's just not, it's, don't do it. It's not the way to do it. It's how I did it forever. I don't know why it took me so long to upgrade to something like this. It's the Cold TI Titanium Cold Storage Wallet. This thing is fireproof, waterproof, damage proof. It's pretty cool. Um, this is held together with these little screws here. So we'll just quickly pop this off and I'll show you what this thing looks like on the inside. Um, you're gonna have two ways that you can purchase this. One is just how you're seeing it here, which is just the plates. And then the other way that you can purchase this is with uh, the stamps, the metal stamps that you're gonna use to kind of engrave this. And that's how you're gonna be storing your seed words is, is kind of engraving this on a piece of titanium. So now that you've got those screws off of there, you can go ahead and flip these open and you can see they're numbered here. I'm gonna put this one down, but they're numbered one through 12, 13 to 24. So if you've got a 12 seed word phrase or maybe the 24 seed that most people are coming out with today, uh, this is gonna store them both. And like I said, you can purchase this one of two ways. In this package here, you've just got the two uh, seed wallets about credit card size. And the other way you can purchase it comes with these stamps here, these little uh, stamping tools. And essentially all you're gonna do is you're gonna need a hard surface, something like a jeweler's block here. Um, you're gonna put your, your storage wallet down. You're gonna take your, your little stamp and you're just gonna hammer in the letters. That's it, that's all you're gonna do. You're gonna store it. Now this thing's gonna keep your stuff safe. It's gonna keep it secure. You're not gonna have to worry about a fire destroying it, a flood destroying it. Uh, obviously you're gonna have to worry about somebody stealing it from you. So you wanna keep it secure. Uh, however you do that, that's on you. But this is something that I thought was very cool. I don't know how long these have been out, but I found it and I found it to be pretty affordable. Uh, the other thing that I'll, I'll point out to you is these come with the um, little holographic stickers. So this way, if you wanted to, you could kind of seal this up and you'll know if somebody broke the seal to open it up. Um, but if you keep this secure, you, I mean, you probably don't have to worry about that, but it's an extra cool little bonus feature here. Uh, if you look at the packaging, it's pretty straightforward. It tells you what to do. There are videos uh, on YouTube from the manufacturer that will show you essentially how to do this stuff. It shows you how it's fireproof, how it's damage proof, all the, all the different tests that they've done on it. Um, now I will say this, you'll see other companies that maybe have spindles, where you put the words in the spindle, or there's like little beads, if you will, that kind of go up. Anything that's mechanical like that, I would avoid because there's, you know, they can get destroyed, the words can get mixed up, and then you're screwed. This is engraved, stamped, carved, whatever you want to do. You can get an engraver and engrave this. You, it's not going to get destroyed. You're not going to have to worry about the words or the letters getting mixed up. So this is definitely the way that you want to do it. Uh, but that's it for me, guys. I'll talk to you again real soon. Peace out, YouTube.